Hey guys, Pepper Magnus here. Just doing a quick, uh, quick little video tour of uh, of our new garden expansion. I moved it. I moved it over from the uh, from my old garden plot uh, uh, that you seen last year, and maybe a couple of years before that too. Um, the, the last couple of years, it's been getting wet and staying wet and not draining off very well for me, and I've been getting a very late start. So. What we did this year, as you can see, let me just get that in the video. Ooh, hoo, hoo. We've uh, we've just about finished the greenhouse. Okay, it's just a simple timber frame and uh, one inch PVC pipe hoops over. Okay, and plastic. Some good heavy 10 mil plastic. Now, if we take a look around, you can see I busted up this all the ground in my old feeding pen, my winter feeding pen. Okay, so here we go, let's take a look. It's not quite, I'm not sure, I think it's about half an acre in here, okay? And we'll take a little quick walk up here. Okay, and I'm kind of jealous of you guys in the States, how you've, uh, They've already got plants coming up and everything. <laughs> it's kind of funny, actually. Um, anyhow, yeah, I've tilled this up twice now, and I'm going to go over it one more time. And as you can see, there's not much, there's not much green stuff popping up, eh? So that's a good sign. Uh, right here, right here, we're uh, building a, a compost, a compost box, and I'm going to line that up with plastic and and give it an all nice coat of uh, pine tar just to keep it from rotting and drying out and such. Uh, right along here, I'll stand right at the very end. Right along here, you can see I tore down all the rails off my old fence here. Uh, I'll be putting them back up again on the outside and, uh, and putting... Uh, putting page wire, two, uh, two rows of page wire up on it to keep the deer out. Of course some flags and stuff keep them scared off but these are our raised beds through here. What I used on this is, uh, where's the, oh here's a good example right here. What I did here is I happened to have found a, uh, a pallet of old, really really old uh, asphalt shingles that are, that are no good anymore. They're, they're very very old. Um, and I laid a layer down on the ground, put the, uh, put the old power pole pieces on top, and, uh, then lined the inside, of course, with the asphalt shingles to keep it, to keep them from, uh, uh, to keep them from getting rotten from the, uh, from the dirt. Okay, and then, of course, you see we're filling them all up along here quite nicely. And what was really funny today... <laughs> Is uh, uh, the wife and I went to the went to the old shopping mall there, i.e. the uh, the dump, <laughs> and somebody had left uh, a bucket full of raspberry canes. So we we grabbed them and promptly threw them in uh, one of our raised beds here. Uh, she's going to be going over tomorrow uh, to the to, to to the old garden. And grabbing the rest of them and filling these, filling all these raised beds up with all the raspberry canes. Okay. And while she's doing that, I'm going to continue on here, popping rails. I'm going to pop all these rails down and and uh, continue on with the uh, raised beds all the way, all the way around. Okay. All the way around. Alrighty. Whoa, I'm getting eaten alive. And pop over here real quick and you see I've started busting up some new ground uh, right over here oh the hole okay <laughs> now right out here outside the fence I uh, I went and busted all this up and I'm gonna keep doing it all summer uh, in an effort to uh, help keep the weeds from encro uh, the weeds and the grass from encroaching into the uh, into the new garden all right, so it's a fair sized garden. Uh, and we do have people coming out to uh, 
to learn a few things and we're going to be talking about uh, soil erosion and and making uh, making small fences uh, types of fences they're kind of like a wind they're kind of like a wind or a snow fence uh, to help keep the soil from blowing away all right so you can see that that's another nice big patch right here okay and I'll finish that off tomorrow also after I get all those like I said after I pop all the rails and uh, and get all get all the rest of the this grass all tilled in tilled in really hard okay I oh, may as well give you a view of the whole thing here eh? so yeah this is my property all the green that you see is my property it's a little 10 acre patch this is the east end and uh, yeah this is the east this is the east side I uh, can't see the west side from here there's a the house it's over in behind there <laughs> okay so here's the old manure pile we're digging out of uh, to fill up all of our raised beds and I'll be taking a few loads in up there to uh, to enrich the soil a little bit in the new garden there's actually a lot more here than what it looks like uh, it spreads out down here to where my feet are of course this is from when I had uh, piles and piles of animals cows horses sheep chickens pigs turkeys ducks geese all those pains in the neck hey and goats I've even had goats yeah all right so this is even a little bit better of a view maybe from down here I'll go stand on top of that I'll go stand on top of that crap pile here <laughs> there you can see how the land rise you can see how the land rises up a bit over there okay so over in that field there uh, by by this fall here I should have a lot of that ground broke over there and I'm going to be putting uh, our orchard in over there. Uh, we've got uh, almost 40 trees of various types ordered for over there. That that little field over there is, I think it's roughly th uh, three acres over on that side. All right. We'll take a quick pan around. Hey. And I'm getting eaten by mosquitoes. Okay, guys, I got to go. Take care. Bye.